So, you know, we're getting near the end of the party and one of the things I'd like to do is share what is <coughs> the most recent Irish song that I've, um, that I've come across. Because even though we live here in the States, we stay very much in touch with the culture back home and the music. And uh, this song is absolutely fabulous. I just introduced it to the band. It's so new that we couldn't find chords and poor old Phil had to pull an all-nighter to try to figure out the chords. So thank you, Aoife Scott. When I send you this video, you'll know. You put us through a lot of work, but we love your song. And Aoife is an artist in her own right. She just released her new CD, which I own. It's fantastic. And uh, she also comes from a great heritage in Irish music. A lot of the songs that we're singing for you today were made famous by <coughs> Mary Black, a very famous Irish singer, and her sister Frances Black. And Aoife happens to be Frances Black's daughter. So we'd like to pay tribute to all the Black family for the gift they've given us in our culture, and especially to Aoife Scott. We wish her the best of luck in what is going to be a wonderful career ahead of her. And uh, the tourism note on this song, which is called All Along the Wild Atlantic Way, do come to Ireland, do visit, you will get a warm welcome. But for the love of God, don't just fly into Dublin. Go to the Atlantic Way, which is on the West Coast, because that's where the beauty is. together to do the halfway to St. Patrick's Day event. We're not sure of the venue yet, but uh, keep an eye out for shenanigans because we're on the move. Um, <clears throat> 